Hello everyone, today in this video we will fight against the advanced character of our water Amnes and today I would like to mention very good novel, actually set of novels written by French writer of Russian origin uh, Mrs. Zoe Oldenburg from the surname of this lady because it is her maiden name we see that this woman who lived uh, from 1916 till 2002 uh, came from the uh, was coming from the elite of the Russian Empire, uh, which was in most cases of Western European origin, mainly German and uh, to lesser extent uh, Flemish, Dutch, and Walloon, but mainly mainly German. This lady was coming from a family of seemingly uh, more. Uh, Dutch origin and uh, she um, started her writing career in 1946 when her first novel translated in English later as Life is Not Enough war has been published. Uh, her uh, stories in most cases were set mainly in the period of <coughs> European medieval times, uh, especially European hal hal High Middle Ages, 12th and 13th century, and uh, they are characterized by naturalism, by very nice, realistic, but beautiful plot. I have to say that she was a master in depicting uh, human characters and relations between men and women and different level of course everything is uh, set in a greatly presented medieval scenario of medieval everyday life uh, there is not so much uh, big history going on of course there are some main characters participating in crusades in palestine there are some events described in the Champagne, the region where the characters of this novel come from, close to Tro Troje, city of Troje. Uh, but uh, the main focus of these stories, great historical novel, is medieval community of uh, French-speaking people at the High Middle Ages presented as its best in terms of realism, in terms of psychology of the characters and uh, human uh, interactions at any level. This is a pleasure to read uh, such novels and I have to say that I recommend them. Of course there are another sequels uh, of this novel World is Not Enough uh, there is a cornerstone and there, are, there is another one that follows. Author doesn't uh, hide her views. She, oh, she was really a sympathizer to the Qatar heresy, but despite her preferences and views that she didn't like the opponents of Qatars, her novels have a lot of uh, objectivity uh, prevailed, uh, objectivity in terms of the description of medieval times. That's why they are worth, <coughs> sorry, that's why they are worth reading and uh, we need to also take into account that sometimes uh, Mrs. Oldenburg makes small mistakes. For instance, uh, she mentioned in her novel, uh, the the one I'm talking about, the word is not enough English title, that uh, one's main character was tanned and dirty, uh, she uh, described him that he resembles a gypsy. Uh, one needs to say that first evidence of gypsies in the territories of Western Europe, like France, Champagne, uh, the oldest evidence is about 15th century, not the 12th, 13th century, in which this novel series uh, is set. 
maybe it was a uh, licencia poetica or li literary technique to give a comparison to the reader to make reader more understand what author meant but despite this small flow the, this is a really great set of novel i really encourage you to read them all the best have a nice day bye